Welcome to another beta stash video. Today I'm going to be helping you keep your feet on the wall with a 6 minute core and stomach routine. In this workout I'm going to be showing you 6 exercises which work your abs, obliques and core. Make sure you have good strong form for these exercises to get the most out of it. Each of these exercises takes a full minute to complete. You want to be doing 20 seconds on and 10 second rest and then another 20 second, 10 second rest before moving on to the next in the sequence. The bent knee pike beginner version starts with the ball positioned at the knees and gets harder as you move the ball closer to your feet. Focus on using your stomach to bring your knees closer, squeeze your bum and make sure not to arch your lower back. Once you advance to holding one leg out, your core works a lot harder to keep your hips at an equal height on both sides. Make sure you choose a version of this exercise that you can achieve whilst feeling solid and having good control. Fewer reps of a harder exercise helps to build power and strength. The hollow rock needs to be done with control, so make sure to keep your lower back rounded and your stomach engaged for this one. The beginner version often starts with arms at your side, but you can also make this easier by bending your knees initially. Once you've got that down, you can lift your arms above your head and gradually drop your legs more and more as you get stronger. There should be no slapping sound as your back makes contact with the mat. Make sure to breathe and focus on quality of movement as opposed to just making yourself tired. The jackknife is a super cool stomach workout which requires a few specific guidelines to maximize results. Really reach your feet towards the ceiling as much as you can while squeezing your legs, bum and stomach. Keep your knees straight throughout the exercise and as close to your face as possible on the way down. Remove your hands from your hips and place them flat on the ground to make this exercise harder. Make sure your back touches the ground one vertebra at a time and be careful not to arch your back at any given point. Relax your neck and shoulders and breathe into the base of your chest. The L-sit is a deceptively challenging exercise that works your abs, core and shoulders. Initially you'll do this exercise with your hands on yoga blocks or parallettes for extra height or with your knees close to your chest. Once you can do that, you'll begin trying to straighten your legs. It takes a little while to learn how to achieve this exercise, but once you've learned to coordinate your muscle recruitment well, it's a super way to improve both strength and endurance. Side flexion is an important functional movement in pretty much any sport you'll do. You need to keep your lower back imprinted and your belly pulled in to do this right. Pop a tennis ball under your chin if you're struggling to keep your neck relaxed. Divide this part of the workout into tapping your heels to achieve the side movement for the first half of the rep and twisting your hips into side flexion for the second half. This can be a difficult exercise to get your head around initially, but with a bit of practice you'll find your range starts to improve as does your control. This is a brain exercise as much as a stomach one, so take the time you need to learn how to do it properly. Last but not least, we're doing the Russian twist. This exercise is designed to bring in a rotation element, so make sure you focus on distributing this twist across your whole spine while maintaining a strong stomach contraction so as not to let your lower back arch. Just because it's burning doesn't mean your posture is right. This is a notoriously tiring exercise, so make sure you're keeping the level of control high. If you're still feeling strong after that routine, then double it up with a two minute rest in between. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you have any questions about the routine, please leave a comment below. See you next week for our next Beta Stash video.